Well, here in Portsmouth, school starts on Tuesday, and what students may notice is the school resource officer is not going to be a city police officer, rather a sheriff's deputy. And this has taken some last minute behind the scenes work to make sure that all the students and staff across the city are safe. School resource officers are essential personnel. Dr. Michael Cromarty is working to ensure safety inside Portsmouth Public Schools. However, just a couple of weeks ago, he learned the Portsmouth Police Department plans to move personnel designated as school resource officers to the streets for its patrol unit. In fairness, they, they are dealing with some critical issues with staffing, and, and we're sensitive to that. We understand that. Detective William Watts with the Fraternal Order of Police says they are very concerned about the current staffing problem. Our big concern is the reason that void is there is because of retention issues with the police department. Now, the Portsmouth Sheriff's Office will provide deputies to serve in the schools. So we got confirmation that they were not going to be able to provide that service to us. Fortunately, we were able to go to an agency that, that had the manpower and the willingness to help us out. Detective Watts is concerned partly because he knows officers from the police department have spent a lot of time fostering relationships that he says ultimately lead to safety in schools. They get to know the kids. If there is any problems in the schools, uh, they get to know that as well so they can identify it early on. Not only that, they have specialized training such as active shooter training. News 3 asked Sheriff Moore about his staffing situation as well as their training. He said they're in pretty good shape staffing wise and when talking about the deputies, he said many of them work throughout the city and community anyway and some are former school resource officers. He added that the sheriff's office will be providing additional training. And it appears this may be a permanent change. Sheriff Moore says the jobs are being transferred from the city to the sheriff's office a move the school seems to support. I think that's going to be the way we forge ahead. Now, each of Portsmouth's four high schools and three middle schools will have its own school resource officer. The staff members will alternate amongst the elementary schools, which I'm told is the same as it was in the past. Now, this position is in addition to the school security officer, which is a district employee, someone you might normally see at the front desk checking visitors in. Reporting live in Portsmouth, Angela Bohan, News 3.